Hi everyone, what is up? My name is Haley. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If you did not know, no, you, you, hey you guys, what's up? So in today's video, y'all, as you can see from the title and thumbnail, I'm doing a fun video, for me at least. It's probably going to be a little embarrassing because uh, 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 I'm reacting to myself, actually. Um, I'm reacting to a video that a lot of y'all have already seen. It's You Know You Are Dating a German guy, man, when this is something that I did many years ago. I have not watched it in a very long time. And so I'm going to be reacting to it in this video. But with all that being said, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to follow me on Instagram. But before we get into the video, y'all, I just want to say thank you to today's sponsor, which I'm going to be using actually in this whole video, y'all. And it is or are my Soundcore Space A40 headphones. If you're in the neighborhood for some new wireless noise cancer, sling earbuds, I can highly recommend the Soundcore Space A40. Um, they come in, I believe, three different colors, black, navy, and white. I chose the white. I think it looks the sleekest, but these things, not only are they long lasting, um, they cancel out the noise around you like no tomorrow. <laughs> like if I want to be in my own personal bubble, these things um, they put me in that bubble. The earbuds automatically identify noises around you and it basically adapts to your surroundings. And so sometimes it'll be more noise canceling than others, but it's really interesting how it can pick up all of the different noises around you and what to cancel, what to make louder and what to maybe subdue a little bit more than the others. The audio, you guys, is very crisp. <laughs> it feels like you, the person, let's say you're listening to music, it feels and sounds like the person is whispering in your ear like they are singing and serenading you in your ear. I have been wearing them up and down. I think I received them three weeks ago and I have not charged them since and they're still kicking. I just listened to them on the train for like I would say two hours and then I took them to the gym today and it was an hour and a half and they are still kicking and like I said I received them three weeks ago I won't give or take and I haven't charged them since then and they are still working and yeah all of that you can receive or you can get them for for a very nice 99 euros. They're available in Germany and they were just released a few days ago, I believe a week ago. And so yeah, if you guys wanna check them out, I will link everything down below. And so with all that being said, thank you to Soundcore for sending these over and let's get right into the video and I'm gonna put them in my ear right now, you guys. <laughs> So before I start my reaction, I want to give you guys a little backstory of how this all came to be. Some of y'all might not even recognize me in this video because I look a little different. I was a little bit thinner. But what happened was I was just starting my YouTube channel and this was in 2016, you guys. And I got, I think, an email or a message on Instagram. And it was basically the woman that runs this channel asking me if I wanted to be an actress in the... Um, in the video and of course I said yes. I believe she asked someone else and she actually had someone else instead of me but the person maybe canceled last minute and yeah that's how it came to be. It was pretty pretty cool not gonna lie. You know not just coming over you have to go a bit more straightforward than that. <laughs> what do you mean like I have to go to him? So the first thing I want to say, you guys, is that the guy that's sitting next to me, I knew him. I actually don't remember how we knew each other. He was a friend of a friend. And I think that one of the people that they wanted in the video, um, they canceled last minute as well. And so they were scrambling to find people. And I think technically they wanted another girl, but I didn't have another girl. So I was like, do you want to be in this video? And yeah, the other guy, I never met him before you guys. It was the first time meeting him. I think we um, talked a little bit beforehand, but um, I didn't know him. And also there are a lot of people behind the scenes um, doing this. And also we filmed at the hostel and mention a top on hoof. If I can remember the name, most of this was done in that hostel. It's so funny though, I also have to pause that even though this is six going on seven years <laughs> old, this video, some of the stuff is still very much so true. I still agree with this um, little passage right here that's inserted 1000%. Um, it will probably be a relief for him if you are the one to approach 1000%. I'm the one that approached Mike and then look at where we are now, happily together since this actually, this video went up. It's so crazy how cold it is here. Like it's freezing cold here. How can you deal with this? Mm. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, and also, I'm still like this. This, uh, you know, granted this was me being a little bit over-exaggerated, but 1000% I'm still like this, uh, not into small talk. I don't like small talk that, um, that much either, but when it comes to cutting people off, <laughs> I'm so bad at this, you guys. So I thought you'd be good to do a hookup. But since now that I got to know you better, uh, I think we can go on a date. What do you say? Hmm. <laughs> now, so I think this is a, low, a little over-exaggerated um, to an extent. I feel like someone with manners wouldn't say something like this, but they would be brutally honest. I do think that you have to be a little, how do you say, over the top with these types of videos because it gets people to view it. And so granted, I don't think people are going to, that many, let's say men, are going to be um, like him, but I do think that honesty goes a very long way in Germany. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I haven't even read these in a long time. Uh, oh, hello. look it. Oh, I hi. Hi, it's me. How are you? Good, how are you? Yeah, fine. Uh, listen, um, I booked a nice table. <laughs> Wait, let me just tell you guys. So this was all shot in the same day, I'm pretty sure. So this um, part was filmed a little bit later, if I, if I remember correctly. It was filmed later in the evening, and it was actually relatively early when we filmed this, even though it was so dark. And we weren't expecting it to get so dark so early, especially me. I don't even think, yeah, this was my second or first year in Germany and they were asking me like tips and tricks and what time. And then I'm like, oh yeah, we can do it at like six. And then 4.30 rolls around and it's completely dark and we're like rushing to film everything and lights and we're like rushing to find lights in the city. And so this was at um, Odeansplatz, you know, I mean, you can pretty much see where it's at. It's literally right at Udiansplatz, where both of us are standing. It's just he's standing in a different angle. Um, but yeah. So I live at Scheidplatz. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, I know that. Uh, listen, you, you can check Google Maps, right? Because it should be just... And then me saying Scheidplatz, that's <laughs> just a random place that used to be sort of near where I live. Not really, but it's just um, a tram station or U-Bahn station that I knew. <laughs> And that was the only place I said, because I didn't want y'all knowing my address. Um, and also this for me, you guys, I was freezing cold. I was not prepared. It was raining. <laughs> I didn't have an umbrella. I had this jacket that didn't have a hoodie. Uh, and I was so cold. <laughs> I think underneath this, I only had my little t-shirt on and it was freezing. Shouldn't be too hot, shouldn't be too far. Yeah. Okay, listen, I gotta go. Um, <laughs> see you there at five. Bye bye. Oh my gosh, this is so true though. I do have to say that I was very lucky with Mike because Mike liked to drive, he drove everywhere. And so when it came to dates, I had someone to pick me up. But I've also been in the predicament with German men where they didn't have cars and they just wanted to meet at the place, not even like come to my house and like pick me up and walk me there. They'd be like, why do you want to do that? I'd be like, because we're going together. And so yeah, <laughs> had a few experiences like that. How are you? Good, how are you? Fine. Um, I hope a good different. Oh, well, you definitely got more makeup on this time. <laughs> <laughs> and the funny thing is that the makeup wasn't really that different because, like I said, we were like going from place to place and it was just us by ourselves walking to do the video. And so I had this little makeup bag and granted I already had a lot of makeup on even in the first video that was like my base. And then all I did differently was like smoke out my eyes a little bit more and put on like a darker red lipstick. So I find it to be funny and the video, it sort of looks like a lot, but it really wasn't a lot. Hmm. Would you like some bread? Is that supposed to be bread? <laughs> so this was also filmed in the hostel and it was hilarious. I don't know where they got this bread from. <laughs> I really don't know where they got it from. They're just like, oh, let's talk about the bread. And <laughs> they just brought out the bread and I was like, okay. We had to film this a few times and I think this was the end 
of the video and I just like changed my shirt, but it was all filmed, like I said, in the same day. And so all I did was put on this new shirt, try the spread and we like filmed this. I think this was the part that took the longest to film. I don't know why though, because it was so simple. Okay. At 7.25 a.m. <laughs> uh -huh. we get up, naturally. Okay. And he really wrote this list, you guys. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes, y'all, this is so funny because as much as Mike likes to disagree and say he's not like this, um, he's like this. And that I find to be hilarious because he despises any type of German stereotype, but he fits them perfectly. For me, I'm the complete opposite of this. I don't wanna schedule when I go on vacation. I don't need everything mapped out. Um, but this has happened to me many times before on many different dates or guys that I've been dating for like an extended period of time. We do a trip together, go on a trip together. They like plan out everything. And I'm like, oh gosh, I just want to relax. It's like, oh, I came here for a vacation. And then they're like, let's do stuff. I'm like, I don't want to do activities. I work. That's an activity. <laughs> what we thought about it. And make sure to check out Haley's channel. Oh, I'm going to link down below. Look at so how cute Look at how good I am, you guys. I look so uh, different, but I was so, I was so nervous and so excited to do this, you guys. And Marina was so nice that she picked me and that she let me be in it. And she was also very kind, you guys. She did everything by herself. That's also something. All of the ideas, a lot of the writing, the filming, she doesn't necessarily do, but she plans everything out by herself. And that's really crazy. Oh my gosh, that was so cute. Oh my gosh, it's been so long, been so many years, and there were so many good memories attached to that video. You guys, let me take out my headphones first so I can hear myself talking because it just sounds very like whoosh. But yeah, that was filmed during the beginning of my Germany Munich adventure, you guys. And I remember how excited I was to be in that video. And then when it went live, I never experienced the amount of um, just love uh, or how do you say traffic on my channel. <laughs> I think that I got like 10,000 people following me in the course of a month, which was a lot for me. And I was just like, holy moly, what's happening in the video? It sort of went viral. Like, I mean, it has 1.2 million views. And for me, that was unheard of, unseen of. And yeah, um, but that was the end of the video, you guys. And I know that a lot of y'all have seen it. Hopefully I shared some info about it that you didn't know before. Other than that, thank you so much for watching, you guys. Thank you to Soundcore for sponsoring this video and for sending me my new Space A40 babies here. Like I said, I will link everything down below. If you guys wanna check them out, you want some amazing noise canceling, long lasting headphones. And yeah, with all that being said, thank you and bye.